What's up everyone, Hailstorm here, and welcome to Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Uh, this playthrough, I, I am really excited about this. I have played Xenoblade Chronicles 2, but I have never played the first Xenoblade. And uh, since they released this on Switch, I figured, why not give it a shot? So, we're gonna go ahead and get started here. Alright. Oh, look at this, it even knows I've already played. Sure. Looks like they're gonna get, let us start with some extra money. That's pretty cool. Long ago, the world was nothing more than an endless sea, cloaked in a boundless sky, reaching as far as could possibly be imagined. Guys are huge. Then two great titans came into existence. The Bionis and the Maconis. Titans were locked in a timeless battle. Until at last, only their lifeless corpses remained. Eons have passed. Now, our world, this vast land stretching across the remains of the Bionis, is under attack from a relentless force known as the Mekon. advancing down our weak right flank. For a bunch of soulless machines, they seem to know a thing or two. Ooh. But we'll see. That's the sword that Shulk uses, is it not? Maybe. I don't know. Young man. We've been given the order to retreat. We're pulling back the line to Colony 6. That's where we'll set up the last line of defense. Yeah. That's a good idea. Any more time spent hanging around here, and we're done for. Count me in. We gotta get out of here. Or we can stay and fight. What? Ah. Do fight. We ah. may die if we take a stand here, but staying gives us the chance to change our destinies. We Spoken have the Monado. Like a true warrior. With this, the future is ours for the taking. Stupid mm. beast. <laughs> Your body can't take any more of the Monado. I can tell by just looking at you. Getting short-sighted in your old age, Dixon. I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm still in control. Hmm. I should have known I couldn't talk sense into a beast. Let's do this. I'm going with you. He is a beast. You'll need him. someone to drag your corpse off. As long as you think you've still got the strength in you, old man. Oi, you two! We've been ordered to pull back! I'm leaving! Well, I say you're coming with us. <laughs> what would we do without those? <sighs> The enemy's second wave is approaching! 
It's now or never, Dunban. Let's show them what we got. We'll give them a warm Homs welcome. Acknowledged. Yeah! Ha! What are they trying to prove? I'm not throwing my life away. No point dying in some godforsaken field. Nothing for it. I'll have to use Dunban as a decoy. Yeah, that should give me time to escape. <laughs> what a coward. Come on, man. Oh! Right into it. Okay, so monster. Character. Press L or R, so both work to target. Target an enemy to display the battle palette. Okay. Fight icon. Select the fight icon and press A to start the battle. Close, yes. Approach to auto attack. If you're too far, you can't attack. So that's very similar. To, uh, Select arts with left and right. Press A to confirm. Okay, so the art is on the right. Okay, cool. Two different arts. Monado Enchant and Monado Buster. Major damage or power up party members. Okay. So we just did the enchant. That's cool. I guess it shows a gauge around. Oh, I got a that shows me. There's a gauge around where to show when I can do it. Okay, so now I can actually taste the a ton of damage with that. That are How come I'm level 27? Dunban, you the weak sauce. Oh, oh, next. No, what can you check? Oh, hey, oh, that's right. Okay, that's different. I think everything in uh, Xenoblade 2 was auto. He thought they would pull out their swords and everything automatically. Uh, how do I? Okay. Power up our bodies. We're not close enough. Okay. He's getting lower. Okay, so the circle on the ground is the one that they're focusing on. Oh, nice! So I don't have to, have to run the whole time. It's not, oh, <laughs> just up close. So it's like, what's it doing? Ooh, missed. No good. So. There we go. Ooh, so much fun. You've got to be kidding! It's their main force. They Looks like the Mechon are hell-bent on taking us out. They'll have to be if they want to beat us. Now, let's even the odds a bit. You heard him. So we're going to keep fighting, maybe learn some more. Dixon, Munka! Uh, this is where his let's buddy's going to run away. Ah! Dixon and Munka. And I'm Dunbar. Dunban. Oh. I ain't going down that easily. Dunban, are you all right? Oh, what does it look like? I'm still good to go. <laughs> Guess even a hero's got to reach his limit eventually. Mumka, what are you doing? That way is... Sorry, brothers. Hate to drop this on you, but it's the Monado they're after. So have fun keeping them occupied for me. I'm getting the hell out of here. Mumka, you dirty. Ah, don't worry. I'll organize your funerals. <laughs> well, see you, boys. Wait. Huh? Ah! Oh. If this is a joke, it ain't funny. Looks like this is it. At least we know our luck can't get any worse from here. Dumbad! Dixon, take care of the survivors! 
dump out. What are you playing at? <sighs> Those idiots. I'll just come and get the banana when everything's quiet down a bit. That thing's gonna be mine! <laughs> Big mistake. Oh, oh no, oh, please! No! Vile Beckham. If you think the Hobbs, the people of Bionis, are just waiting here for you to pick us off, you are sorely mistaken! The perfect anime yell. Listen to it. The, uh, these guys, the titans that were fighting earlier, the ginormous mecha, kind of reminds me of a... It's got a very much of a Gundam vibe to it. The Japanese mecha fighting. I'm excited. This looks really sweet. Very well, well made. Good story. Good characters. Beautiful graphics. That's one of the things I loved about Xenoblade 2. So one year later, a Mechon M71. I bet I can use its optical system to align one of the anti-air batteries. Ah, oh, no good. It's broken. Ah, this the must joint be short. section. Yep. Sure enough. It's buckled. It's completely useless. Ugh. Huh? An M sixty nine. So he's a scavenger for parts. That's what it looks like. Its armor would be perfect for making a shield. If I can just get it off, I should be able to... Ah! Ah! <laughs> no good, buddy. Shulk! <laughs> oh, it's still alive. Or something. Ryan! Ryan. It's not a mechon. It's just a crabble. I've seen crabbles. It was right. using the mechon armor as a shell. I'll lure it away in top of it. When it's down, use your arts to finish you it up. You the same idea I did, using it as a shield. <laughs> okay. Lock on, press A, get close. The HP gauge is depleted, the character will be incapacitated. Okay, so that's the HP. Select an art, press A to confirm. Shulk's arts, he has a backslash, and whatever the other one is. Oh, heal, restore HP. I could have guessed that. Select who will be healed. Well, me, obviously. You're a lifesaver. Backslash. You cannot use the same art repeatedly. Once the cooldown period is finished, yeah, I figured that. So it looks like my buddy's taking the damage. Keep attacking. There we go. Each character has a special art called a talent art. Select the talent art icon and press A to use it. Okay. The gauge. Yep, the gauge must be full. Got it. Defeated enemies will drop treasure chests. Take all. Small shell and iron crabble shell. Nice. Green ring stops you from escaping. Okay, cool. Okay, the enemy should be defeated. Oh, okay. There's another one. Pile. Beware of aggro during battle. Aggro is the measure of monster's feelings and animosity towards each member of the party. The more damage a monster takes, the more aggro. Cool, just generic RPG stuff. Shulk's backslash deals more damage if he attacks the monster from behind. Okay, called bonus effect. Cool. Use the aggro rings to help find the best position. Okay, so if he's aiming at one of my buddies, I can find where his rear is. That makes sense. So right now, he's at me. 
I just move around for a bit. So now he's now he's mad at him, so I can back slash. Nice. Yeah. Well, I didn't really need it, actually. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. That was a close one. Man, what were you doing wandering off by yourself? Stay where I can keep an eye on you. <laughs> it's pretty dangerous outside of the colony. There are all kinds of monsters. Yeah. But thanks to you, we got its shell. Everyone in the colony is going to be really happy. I'm more worried about you than the shell. No, oh, whatever. <laughs> Knowing what you're like, at least you'll make a decent weapon out of it. This scrap driver's excellent. I just learned by watching Dixon make weapons. Of course, Dunban's weapon still beats them all. The Monado. The I hope I can figure out the secret of his power one day. You will, Shulk. Anyway, we better get back to the colony. If so I'm is the Monado again, the name Square of the... Tash is gonna kill me. Square Tash? Oh, the Defense Force Colonel. He's pretty scary. Tell me about it. Sorry, I didn't mean for you to come all the way out here during your break. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Let's get back. So he needs to he wants to harness the power to use the Monado. Follow the dotted path to advance the story. The path to the next main story's objective is displayed on the mini-map. Cool. Press ZR to display guidance panel. Okay. I need to check the story memo. Press ZR while the guidance panel is open to close it. the camera, additional camera controls, system menu where you can save progress, auto save, nice, view the tutorials, awesome, oh my goodness, <laughs> so many messages that pop up, the event theater is now available from the game title screen, okay, So that, okay, here we go. So that shows me the camera things. This is the story memo. Shift. Okay. I already uh, looted this, right? Oh, that was the one we just defeated. Okay. Cool. Oh, there's more enemies here. Let's engage. We can definitely do this. Bring it on. Let's go. Right, you never stood a chance. Man, what a bunch of jokers. Easy. Easy. Okay, let's get this guy. I just want to get the uh, practice in here. Alright, I'm feeding it. Backslash. Yeah, my buddy. Oh, I tried to go down. I forgot you can't do it with the joystick. You have to, uh... <laughs> Do it with, uh, the buttons. Okay. I'm turning up the heat. You're really getting into this run. There we go. So now he's facing his backslash. Let's take it all. Now there was an auto run. Oh, just like this. Maybe my buddy will attack first. Yeah, I'm turning up the heat. You're really getting into this ride. All right. I'm wow, he attacks as he runs. That's really cool. See, it doesn't do as much damage when he's when he's looking at me. Catch up, everyone. Who else wants some? We'll kill them super quickly. Going down with a speed. I'm turning up the heat. You're really now getting into this run. I'm really feeling it. Nice. I need to be even stronger. Art learn. How do I figure out about the arts that I've learned? Oh, well. Just have to see what it does, I guess. Gather collectibles. Latest additions to your collection can be registered in the Collectopedia. Fill in a row or collect all the items in an area to receive a reward. Okay. Okay, so it looks like there's you know, fruit, flower, bug. Nice, okay, so just different collect collections. Oh, collectibles. Let's attack. What's this? 
attack from the side to lower the physical defense. Well, I was facing this. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Major attack for his last little sliver of health. You know it. You'll be the one watching my bats. I won't let you down. He doesn't need any health. He's uh, it looks like he just leveled up. So. Level two bunnet. Going down, little bunnet. Max up. Nice. His that goes on him. Let's break. Debuff effect break. Break status topple may be inflicted. Okay, cool. Topple them. Collectibles, plates, no. Take everything. I don't even know what it was, but it sounds good. Alright, I think we're good fighting these guys. We're level 3, so all of these guys are super easy. We could try and rack up some experience. I just kind of want to get through the, uh, the story right now. They don't aggro. How do I un... Oh, I stopped B. Okay, cool. What? I might have missed one of the other one back there, but that's okay. Everyone here is pretty weak. Probably get to an area pretty soon where there's higher level monsters. And at that point, they're gonna auto aggro on me. Colony 9. This is the colony that Shulk is from. Okay. Dude, look at, Here we are. Look at his rain sword. I better stop in at HQ. You off to the weapon development lab? Yeah. When I've sold any parts, I can't use. <laughs> All right. Get me a better weapon like later. yours. Is it Ryan or Rain? I. I'll have to hear it again. It might be Ryan. Okay. Organize party. Change party and equipment. Cool. Okay. Visiting the shops. Every shopkeeper has above their head the little shop looking icon. Make money by defeating monsters and selling your loot. Expensive loot? Expensive loot. Press A to talk to anyone with an exclamation mark. It's a quest for experience. You can trade. The story will progress even if you don't do any trading or complete any quests. However, using these features may give you an advantage, of course. Okay. Let's see what we can find. Oh, hi. You know the soldier who keeps watch in the residential district? Why, yes. Okay. View relationships with the affinity chart. Talking to named residents will register them. Awesome. I also had, okay, trade options, oh, hi. so let's see what that, a trade, no problem. Selecting the item you want. Items are exchanged for one for one. Choose the item you want. Okay. Oh, okay. So it's different than selling. I, I would literally do one for one. anything right now. So, Hi there. Another Moving out again. Yeah. You know it. Selling scrap metal so I can get better weapons. I can feel the power. Ether light. Okay. Well. We used to have five machines. There's only one left. 
Okay, so we got quests here. Hello. Verdant Blue Coal. I'm guessing that's how you say it. Your anti-air battery one. I can't stand the sight of it. Nasty thing with the spiky windows. Take care of it, won't you? Sure. Never turn down a quest, right? I say that now. <laughs> There's somebody this way. This person. Well. I don't believe what a silly fool I am. Lost your key. Can't get back into her house. That's uh, that's unfortunate. Gotta keep a spare. Am I right? Huh. All right. So I thought this guy might be a merchant or something. Hello. I'm not entirely sure. Big clump of metal, or lump of metal, in the cliff, huh? And, uh, I guess. Yeah. I guess I did. <laughs> Gem man stall or gem man stall. Hmm. Can't go in there. Hmm. Is it? Here we go. Who's there? Newman, I got something that might interest you. Rather, something to tell you. It's about this here furnace. When creatures die, they leave ether crystals behind. Huh? Sure, yeah. Yeah, everyone knows that. Come on. Compresses ether crystals and removes impurities, so then I can use it to make ether gems. No reaction. No. Powers of ether crystals, but highly condensed. Nice. Put them in weapons or armor with slots. in your weapon slots. That weapon of yours is in fine. Well, might as well take them all. I don't have to... <gasps> I don't have to pay for them. The gem is inserted into a piece of equipment. Mm, select the gem you wish to equip. Nice. I love this music. It's just so... calm and peaceful. Another quest. Hi there! Some hand bonnets just outside the commercial district. It'd be dangerous if they got inside the colony. Could you go and deal with them? You mean attack things? That's the job I'm best at, clearly. Uh, where is this? Oh, thank you. Hello. Do you know where to find Vang Teeth? My grandma keeps on telling me that she needs two of them. It must be for her handicrafts. Sure. Sure, I'll, I'll do your uh, chores or whatever. <laughs> do everyone's dirty work for them. Okay, so I can. I'm guessing I can choose different uh, quests somewhere. Quest log. Uh, down. 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 Hey. No quest is set active. Let's do the monster quest. That's the one we just got. Defeat monsters that are threatening the safety. Defeat two hand bonnets. Easy. Okay, so do I track this one? Uh, or do I just look at it? Oh, R set is active. There we go. That's the active quest. So then it should change. Usually it like changes the location. Oh, dude, do you see the way? That dude was zipping. He's fast. I'm going to head towards the exclamation points on the map. I'm just going to guess that... Uh, Maybe that has to do with where we want to go. Kind of back the way we came. Maybe? I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, look at that. Exclamation points out from the distance. Probably pointing at bonnets. Little bonnets! Sweet wasabi. Nice. Strong dandelion. Yep, sure enough. Hand on it. Let's get it. Ooh, wait, can I? 
Can I not start with this? Can. Nice. We can definitely do this. Huge attack. Uh, nice that my my health goes back up after a fight, just like last game. By last game, I mean Xenoblade 2. More bunnets. Oh, I should have started with the backslash. Dang it. <laughs> now I can't get behind him. <laughs> so that one's really good when somebody's in the party with you. Oh, man. Toxic. Oh, jeez. So both of them started attacking me. That, uh... <laughs> that is unfortunate. Well, let's give that another shot. Maybe it'll load me back in this area. Okay, good. Return to a previous landmark. Okay, cool. Rain is at its shift now, so Schultz decides to go to the laboratory. Alright, well, first I gotta kill some hand bonnets. I think I just... Well, I need two more, because I failed on that last one. I kind of expected, uh... Expected the other guy to not attack yet. Uh, kind of surprised me right now. Oh, I wasn't quite behind him. That's a bummer. Yeah! Up. We can definitely do this. Ah! Ha! Ah, oh, this isn't going well. No, no, it's not. Did he miss? Ah! Oh shoot! Ah, oh, they hurt. It hurts so much. All right, I'm feeling it. Heal, 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 heal. Keep attacking, keep attacking. You're almost there. Yes. Quest completed. Got the two hand bunnets. Over the chest. More stiff hair. Awesome. Okay. Oh, oh that's right. That's uh, how I can take a look at my equipment. I was trying to auto run, but that's on the other side. can also look around while he's running. How cool is that? Very awesome. Okay, so heading to the laboratory. Well, or I, or I can do some other quests, but uh, let's see what the uh, see what the other quests say. Uh, how do I do quests? Log again is down. Okay, so once it's complete, do I have to do anything? No, it's just done. Okay. Defeat Verdant Blue Hole. Your anti battery. Ah, so I'm guessing Gigantic Monter because it looks so hard to defeat. Uh, it doesn't give me any uh, any idea how hard it is, but we're going to try it. It doesn't really say, you know, that he's. Uh, that you have to be a certain level to fight him or anything. He's, uh, I wonder if he's somewhat close, because I can see that, the bubble in the distance, exclamation point. But, uh, <laughs> nighttime now. Nice. Wow. Okay. We're gonna head out this way. We're gonna go back outside, try and fight him, and then we'll make our way to the laboratory. actually checked if I can jump. I can. Nice. I knew that was like an attack button, but... Oh, plenty of monsters out here. There it is down there. Sure enough. Now, do I take fall damage in this game? Do I risk it? Ooh, I don't know. Let's, let's do it from a little safer distance. Huh? Okay. 
Well, that did not answer my question. Let's try again, and this time I'll, ju I'll jump. Okay, he does take, <laughs> he does take fall damage. That's good to know. So do not fall. Unique monsters are much stronger than the mon other monsters in the field. Defeat a unique monster and you'll be rewarded with better quality items. I don't know if I'm equipped to do this, but uh, we're going to give it a shot anyways. Nice. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was, uh, he's, a, he's a little strong. I think I'm going to run. I had no idea how strong he was. How do I... Un unlock, unlock the target. Just run. <laughs> okay, well now we know. I'll have to, I'll have to come back for that. I'm a level four, and I, did I, I didn't really see what level he was. Maybe, maybe it told me he was a level like. Maybe it said a level four, but he's really because he's a unique monster. He's just stronger. I'm not sure. He's a level five. So maybe as a level six or seven, I'll have an opportunity to come back, or if I have more people in my party. But that'll be a fight for another day. But let's head to the lab. Let's just move on with the story. I think that'll be that'll be fun to do. I, mean, is, I did have to defeat little things, so I might as well do a quick little fight right now. Okay, so it's, yeah, it is too hard to like run behind them. Yes, <laughs> So it's always good to use the arts sooner so they rebuild, you know, they, you know, you use, the gauge starts building up again as ASAP as possible. <laughs> and, uh, come on, heal, come on, come on, come on, heal. There we go. There we go. Oh, seven HP. That did nothing to him. I'm losing it. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Get away. Okay. <laughs> 15 health left. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take off. Leave, leave me alone. I underestimated your power. So I have to like be in the battle the battle in order to. Uh... Is his health any lower? No, I'm, I'm guessing his health is back up. But now that I can get a solid hit on him. Backslash? There we go. My guess is I can actually win the fight now. Alright, I'm feeling it. We can definitely do this. I want to use this one first. Let's this go. one. Now I can heal. Right, heal. Backslash. This isn't going well. Uh, it's, it's, it could be worse, buddy. It could be worse. Yeah, I'm dead. Right. He's probably I'm gonna get me before I can run away. Six health. Bummer. Well, even with the backslash, I couldn't quite pull it off. Right heal. Huh? Oh, he ran. I was kind of hoping he. <laughs> I could keep going because I healed myself. That's kind of a bummer. Well, we're just gonna move on with the story. That's okay. Heading to the lab, which I'm guessing is maybe quite a ways away. What's this thing? Who's this little guy? Yeah. Would you look at that? It's a. Uh, I forget what you call these guys, but they're in Xenoblade 2. Tora is the name of the one in, in Xenoblade 2. He's a. Uh, uh, Learnt naturally, get stronger to get more arts. Yeah. More experience also gets you more arts. Cool. Good day. Admire your enthusiasm for your work, but don't overdo it. 
Yeah, you're telling me. I'm sick of working. I want to find out what this landmark is. Uh, 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 whatever. It doesn't tell me here. Hmm. That's okay. As I enter the landmarks, it usually tells me. The colony features landmarks in important places and hidden areas and locations of interest. Find all the landmarks and locations in area to open up the complete. I area. can feel the power! Awesome. So here's the lab. One thing I do kind of miss from Xenoblade 2 is the uh, when you're when you're running towards uh, the quest or the story part, it usually told you the distance or you how far idiots! something is. What the hell are you playing at? Uh oh, the colonel's going to explode. Crashing the mobile artillery into a house. <laughs> how long have you been in the force? Sorry, sir. It's just that we were trying to go as fast as we could, like you ordered. But it's impossible to get back to the military district in only 40 seconds. <laughs> I don't want any excuses. Champions don't whine. They win. Yes, sir. You're a disgrace to the uniform. Are you forgetting the shame you brought on this force during joint maneuvers with Colony 6? Stick your back into it, maggots! Move it! Yes, sir. Get the artillery back to the military district double time! Then I want a million press-ups from both of you. And you better not stop until your biceps explode! <laughs> Colonel, we can't move the artillery. What? You better give a damn good reason why. Sir? The impact of the crash damaged the ether conduction cable. The ether fuel proceeded to leak out, and now the cylinder is empty. Well, change the cylinder then! Can't you even do something as simple as that? The auxiliary cylinders have all been used up. It'll be three days until more come in, I guess in, this is going to make me do it. I told you to keep a stock of fuel in reserve! <laughs> Sorry, sir. You're nothing but slackers! <laughs> Yikes! Same old colonel. At this rate, the men will all be dead before they see any action. <laughs> Just tough love, right? <laughs> okay, well... It's not the What's colonel, up? but... Pool below Outlook Park at night? There's a monster called Lake Magdalena that appears there. Cool, alright. Lake Magdalena. Check that out at some point. Hello. It's for modifying my scrap driver for me before. It's great, but I'm slightly worried about its defensive capabilities. Make me a weapon more suited for defense. Cool. Good to know. I will keep that in mind. I will jot that down in my mental journal. <gasps> there it is. All right, Shulk. How are you? Dixon! When did you get back to Colony 9? <laughs> Just now. I see you've been busy. Looks like your Monado research has been going well. I made the right choice leaving you in charge. <laughs> your research notes really helped. So, you can activate it now, then. Well, anyone can activate it. Yeah, loser. The problem is Come on. controlling it. Yeah, for everyone except him. Yes. Dunban if or... If anyone yep. other than Dunban were able to control the Monado, we could surpass any military force in the world. You think so? What are these hidden functions you mention? It's still only conjecture, but it's starting to look like the Monado might be something far more significant than just a weapon for defeating Mechon. I see. Hmm, and the Mechon. evidence to support your theory? It's the symbol that appears in the center when it's activated. Mm -hmm. What I know is, the central piece is made from multi-layered glass. The symbol appears on the top layer, and each layer is constructed differently. 
So it's possible that other symbols could appear on different layers. Which means... The Monado might conceal even more power. Am I right? If we could just... unlock the Monado's power... Dunban! Dunban! This was, what, a year Dunban. ago, I think it was? Don't look like that. I haven't come yet. Shulk. <laughs> Whispering sweet nothings in his ear. <laughs> Told him to do something with the Monado. Maybe he told him he's worthy to wield it. It was the Monado. It was controlling me. Even so, it saved us. Saved our future. Next, it will be up to you. <gasps> Dunban. Well, I better get the supplies delivered to the defense force. I'll drop round the HQ and see how they're getting on. Okay then. Sounds I'll see you later, good, Dixon. Peace. Shulk, you're spending too much time in the lab. Either that or rummaging for junk in the scrapyard. It ain't healthy for a kid your age. That's why you're always looking so pasty. You should get out, get some fresh air once in a while. All right, I'm off. <laughs> Something's gonna happen and he's gonna be forced to take the Monado. Maybe, that's my guess, but we'll see. Like uh, an enemy comes... comes and attacks and then uh, he's forced to learn how to use it. Maybe not right away. Oh, Dunban's still alive. Very injured, clearly. Dunban, are you awake yet? Ah, <sighs> is it time to eat already? You didn't have to bring it yourself. You could have just called me. Don't be silly. Do you want me to feed you? Don't treat me like an invalid. I'm better than I was a year ago. Much better. Oh, I really thought I lost you back then. Yes, but now I'm almost well enough to handle the Monado again. Dunban, don't say that. The Meccan have gone now. Oh, why would you say that? I just mean I'm prepared. Sorry. Okay. More importantly, eat up before it gets cold. I made something really special today. Don't feel like you need to stay here then, Fiora. Go and make your next delivery. Huh? Well, I'm sure you'd like Shulk to try some while it's still hot. That's okay. Shulk has no sense of taste. He'll <laughs> say it's delicious even if it's stone cold. <laughs> In which case, today he would actually mean it. Hmm, <laughs> maybe. I'm fine, Fiora. Off you go. Okay. Dunban, thanks. You're welcome. <sighs> Trying to play the tough guy and he can't even hold a spoon. Look at him. He's... he's helpless. I, I'm not finished yet. I have to be prepared to use the Monado again. Pathetic. If only you could be like Shulk. Oh, now I'm Fiora. Okay, Fiora has made something special for Shulk. Take it to him before it gets cold. Oh! Timed quest! Alright, let's go. Uh, hey, Fiora! Dixon! Looks like you're in a hurry. Where are you off to? I just thought I'd take Shulk some food. I'm on my way to the lab. Shulk's not there right now. Really? 
I just sent him out to get some fresh air. You know where he'll have gone. Outlet Park. That's the one. Okay. Thanks, Dixon. He's at Outlook Park. Okay. Can't imagine why they call it Outlook Park. Probably has an amazing view. Okay, so I kind of recognize where I am. We went over there and fought the, the giant monster. Just kind of want to take a look around. Maybe we'll call it Outlook Park for a reason, right? Ooh, oh, I can fight? Let's try this. Uh, uh, the electromagnetic level five. I feel stronger. Ah, she's pretty tough. Uh, uh, nice. I'm assuming the stuff that she collects. I will get to keep, so... Awesome. The Manado. It's the only sword that's effective against the Mechon armor. They say that before time began, it was wielded by the Bionis. The same Bionis that we all live on. It must have a secret. That's how Dunban was able to destroy so many Mekon. And why he lost the use of his right arm. If I can just unlock the secret of its power... Shulk! Fiora! How sweet. Mm. This is great. It tastes so good. Really? It's amazing. Ah, he's oh, just saying Shulk. that. You say that every yep. day. Not quite. Mm. It's always delicious. But today, it's amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, thank yeah. goodness. <laughs> sure. I used some special herbs we'll and go spices with that. today. So if you said it was just the same as usual, I'd know for sure you had no sense of taste. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. <laughs> The breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this always. Huh? The debris siren. Hmm. That Strange. Be good. There hasn't been much falling lately. Whoa! Got a siren when debris falling from the sky, huh? And then they blast it. That's pretty cool. Oh, how romantic! There might be more on the way. Fireworks, right? The anti-air batteries can't protect us out here. Let's get back to the lab. Okay. Sweet. So now we've got more in our party. Oh, I kind of missed how to change the uh, people in the party, though. Let's see. Characters can shout out an, inf an affinity cry to another party member to encourage or assist them depending on how the battle is going for them. So B. Encourage dispirited party members. Help party members suffering days or topple. Encouragement and help can improve improve the affinity between the two party members. Nice. If the affinity between two party members is deep enough, they can have a heart to heart. Search for the handshake. Each one indicates a possible heart to heart. Why not check the handshake in Outlook Park? Ah, so we can see one right now. You can change the party leaders, the party's leader, 
In the party menu. Okay, so I just go to the main menu and party. Okay. Nice. That's kind of what I wanted to do. Oh, uh, that's not the main menu. There we go. There. Alright. I kind of wish they had a first person view so I can see. Let's see. Move camera. Ah, there we go. Move, move camera. Uh, oh, zoom. Oh! <gasps> oh! Sl slide. Zoom. <laughs> Man, that's still uh, it's a little difficult to get used to, but that is something else, I'll tell you what. Okay. I think I'm getting the hang of it. This, this is zoom. Left and right is just to move around. How do I go up and down, though? Just like that. Okay, so I have to not be holding ZR or whatever. Anyways, that's just crazy camera stuff. Let's do the handshake, heart to heart. View the details of a heart to heart. Sunrise in the park. Hey Shulk, you remember that time we watched the sunrise right here? It was when we were quite young. Yeah, I remember. We came because... Ooh. Ooh. Oh, man. Let's do you and Dunbass. You had a big falling out. Yeah, it wasn't pretty. Really, it had nothing to do with you. But I still dragged you out and made you stay up all night. I'm glad we did it, even though it was only that one time. We talked for hours and hours about our hopes and dreams. You fell asleep on my arm as we looked up at the stars. Aww. How romantic. Oh no! What? What is it? Oh, Shulk. I have this terrible feeling I said something really embarrassing. <laughs> like I wanted to get married? <laughs> what? Um, Shulk, you don't remember what I said back then? Kind of. I <laughs> can't quite put my finger on it. Hold on. I know I'll get it. Uh, don't worry. No need to remember. Forget I even brought it up. Anyway, that's the end of the, that conversation. Let's talk about something else. Okay, whatever you say, Fiora. I think I pulled it off. He doesn't suspect a thing. I hope he remembers one day. But for now, it's just a bit too embarrassing. Did he just like block it from his memory? So, was it that traumatizing? Pick up some of these collectibles. Uh, well, there was a couple more. Right? No? Yeah? No? Ah, guess not. I'm blind. Never mind. Oh, don't jump all the way down there. Look at these feet, though. He's got, like, some goofy feet. I'll tell you, this kid's like Sora Kingdom Hearts. Alright, so back to the story. You know what? You know, No, there's two of us. We can take on, uh... What's his bucket? Alright, she's with me still? Yeah, yeah! Still in my party. We're gonna take on the uh, creature. I've still got him highlighted blue on the exclamation point up there, so. Oh, nice, and now it's changed the path to go to the main quest, so that's good. We're just gonna do a quick fight arena right over here. And jump. Yeah, yeah, no, we're not doing that. Daytime. See sunrise? Too many cliffs. Too many cliffs nearby. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but that's nice to know. Left click in. Okay. Let's do this. I need to do backslash. No, 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 don't you attack me. Bam! Let's break. This isn't going well. 
She's taking the brunt of it. Oh shoot, she's down. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Still not enough, huh? Not with two level fives. Yikes, these guys are no joke. I wonder if the other enemies around the map also increase their, uh, their level. No, level one, level one. While I hit that... Uh, left button in, I did see... I saw a handshake. What was that? There's one over there on the right, but I thought I saw one to the... to the northwest. I'll jump up there. Oh, well, maybe I can't do it yet. I, I'm not sure. Let's just progress the main story. We'll see about fighting this guy in the future. I, I'll have you yet, demon. And we can actually just check this hand, handshake, heart to heart. I keep calling it handshake. It's a heart to heart. Dunman's house. Ooh, a wedding ring. What? Can't view it yet. Okay, so the one I had seen probably wasn't going to be able to do it anyway, so glad I didn't waste my time trying that out yet. Who knows? Maybe I could, maybe I can. Auto run, baby. Nice. Central Plaza. Oh, wait, auto run. There we go. It's hard to get him to run in a straight line. Military district. Weapon death lab. The Monado. Rhein? Rhein. Like, Rhein. like Reinhardt. What okay. are you doing? Sh sh shulk! Uh, oh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just... Oh, no. <laughs> you are not worthy, Rhein. <laughs> Oh, snap. He's inflicting some major damage. Ooh. Oh, Okay, so he didn't hit Fiora. Man, that was close. Ryan! Goodness. Yikes. Oh, Fiora, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Ah. Uh. It's broken! What? What do you mean it's broken? Don't you care about me? I could have died! <laughs> You're not hurt, are you? Oh, dang, The Monado can't cut people. More importantly, what were you thinking, Ryan? Sorry, I, that was I came savage. to ask a favor, but you weren't here. And I saw the Monado, and I know I'm here a lot, but even I need fresh air sometimes. Is your body still feeling numb? We have to be very careful with the Monado. It's not a toy. I know, man. I just wanted to touch it. Didn't know it would do that. Sorry. But is it true? The Monado really can't cut people. The pattern in that circle. Or maybe it's a symbol. I think it shows which power the Monado has at the moment. You think it's a symbol? Well, if I can find a way to increase the number of symbols, I should. I'm sure that's all very clever. But 
Why were you more worried about a machine than me, Shulk? Well, I just... I just explained why. That's not the point! Uh, hey. s sorry. Come on, Shulk. Oh, dear. What has he done? Look at you! Worthless without the Monado! Until I've scrapped each and every one of you! So, of course I want to get my revenge! Your blade, it did not cut deep enough. No! That's intense. Holy moly. Shulk! Shulk! What on Bionis happened there? Ryan. Fiora. Are you okay? Does it hurt? No. Ryan, when you held the Monado, did you see anything? You know, like a blue blade made of light came out. Same <laughs> as just now. I don't mean that. A feeling like time had stopped, and then... Time had stopped. So, was it only me who saw that? That sounds strange. Hmm. Is it another Monado thing? Who knows? Anyway, no matter how good a sword it is, He's that's a visionary. what happens when you hold it. Looks like Dunban really is the only one who can use it. Hmm. I won't let my oh. brother use it ever again. Not after what it did to him. So oh. Dunban's her brother. Sorry. Huh. I, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, the point is, I'm fine. I thought they were an to item. To be honest, this has happened a few so times before. Kind of I've been researching oh, the Monado for a long time. Shulk, don't act as if this is nothing. Look, don't worry about it. Anyway, Ryan, what did you want to ask me about? Oh, yeah, uh, old Square Tash has gone and put me on punishment duty. Fancy tagging along? Punishment? The Colonel was pretty angry today. Did he hit you? Well, whether he hit me is neither here nor there, really. Although, actually, he did end up hitting me. And that ain't all. He made me do a thousand squats and sit-ups. Whoa, nasty. Yeah, and now I have to go all the way to the Magmel ruins and back. So you have to go and collect the ether cylinders? That's the one. They're used to power the mobile artillery. Mm -hmm. Looks like the damage has been repaired. They can't move without the ether energy. And it seems like the fueling station's all out of stock. Is the mobile artillery that big machine that crashed in the residential district? Yeah, probably. You know your way around there, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll go with you. Yeah! Knew you would. Of course. Hold on. The Magmel ruins are in Tefra Cave, right? I heard that there's a male lizard nest there. I couldn't take it if anything happened to Shulk. He's delicate. Not like you, Ryan. <laughs> what are you on about? I'll be fine. Yeah, he's I can take care of myself. delicate little flower. But... Okay, I got it. I'll make you a promise. Shulk won't even get a scratch. A promise doesn't mean much coming from you. Ouch. Hmm. Yeah, Ryan, always keep your she promises trust if me you want to keep your friends. Nah, she doesn't mean it. In the words of Turbo Man. Great, well... I think we're at a good stopping point. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the story so far. Um, really liking it. Just awesome graphics, awesome characters. The The fighting is very similar to Xenoblade 2, which I'm grateful for because it's uh, very easy to carry over. So, uh, Anyways, again, hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think about the game. And uh, we'll catch you on the next episode. Peace.